Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. And this video, working on this once more. Lift up here, installing this uh, quarter window here. And now we have to install the pieces for the door, which includes this. And because we're pretty much doing the weather stripping as well, like this, that we did previously. I'm gonna go ahead and find the weather stripping for this uh, rail here. So we have both parts that we need here. Glass channel weather stripping and the glass channel back. How I know that this is, this one here is it is because it has like felt on one side and it kind of, you see how it's kind of cut for like a corner. And hey, this has a corner. So this is it right here. And this here, because that isn't long enough to go pretty much all the way down where the window, you know, this is the part where the window goes up and down. So this rubber piece here, I believe goes in here where the other piece with the felt here doesn't, you know, reach. So it's pretty much covering the, I believe this one, like around here, all the way down. And the felt piece just covers the surrounding here okay so just like we did with the quarter window here i believe it has some pieces of weather stripping on it still so i'm gonna go ahead and just pry them out and you know take everything out of the channel there and kind of clean it out a little bit so you can prepare it for the new weather stripping yeah all right so now with the rail here cleaned out from the old weather stripping you may ask yourself you know this felt piece here the one side is a lot shorter than the other side and that's because the short side goes down the corner. So it pretty much goes like this. So that's the corner there. Then this side, the longer piece just wraps around the top. To put it in, you kind of just, uh, this is the felt side. Obviously the felt side is gonna grab onto the window. So you just bend it like this and just slide it in there. Slide it into the rail. It's, it's, it's pretty straightforward. So let's go ahead and do this thing. All right, so as you guys can see, this new felt piece is in. Again, it, it's so short from this end here, from where it goes down into the door. But that's where the second piece comes in. But look at this. Dang, it's clean. Again, just tuck it in. Make sure to tuck everything in here. Right. Damn, it's clean, it's clean. Now we take this last piece out here and pretty much the same thing. It doesn't have felt. It's more of a, hmm, it's a little rough than the bottom piece where you actually bend it, you bend it down like this. That way the window can slide up and down here. And this will pretty much take care of this uh, bottom piece here. There, there might be some extra or some excess in the bottom, but we can always cut that out. It's not a problem here. As long as it butts up onto the felt piece, we're good. All right, there you go. Like I said, a little ex excess piece here. But the point is to, as you guys can see, this is where kind of uh, one piece butts up onto the other piece here. So just make sure, you know, that it's there, here. Tuck it all in. And it's pretty much ready to install. But before we actually install this, we actually have to put the window regulator and the window inside uh, because the window goes from on top in and this also goes in from on top. So we have to put the window first, obviously. So let's go ahead and work on the window. So these are the pieces for the window. This is the regulator. This here is another piece for a piece of the regulator, I guess. This piece is what guides this here, goes up and down and well the actual window so what we're gonna do is we're gonna start with the regulator here once we install this we'll be able to pretty much slide the window in onto the rollers which is this this one here and that one over here so the way to actually install the roller is pretty simple to be honest with you what i'm gonna do install it from here the bottom i'm gonna pretty much this has to pretty much sit right here this is where it needs to sit. So that means we obviously we have to take off these screws here. There you go, put them to the side here. And we're pretty much gonna start installing this. Again, through the bottom here. Sit right there, all right? All right, so as you guys can see, when the regulator it is now on, it's just hand tightened 
the screws here. There is gonna be some finagling here once you trying to get it in and stuff, but it's not bad at all. All right, so next up, we're actually gonna throw this piece in, which goes right here from inside out. Pretty much like that with the nuts here, but before we do put it on and tighten it down hand tight, we're actually gonna put some grease on here just to make things easier to uh, for the rollers to slide in, you know, side to side and stuff. So pretty much right now, I'm gonna go ahead and put grease here and on the window sliders as well, here, and probably here too. And obviously this piece as well. All right, so now as you guys can see, everything is pretty greased up. You don't have to go overboard with this. It just needs a little bit just to help it, you know, glide side to side and whatnot. Let's do the window first. That way, you know, we can set it on the, the rollers here. And afterwards we'll put this in and this right now that we have the window set on uh, the rollers here and the rails the top ones now i'm gonna go ahead and put the small piece for this bottom roller here change the plans take off the window i went ahead and installed this uh little bracket here for this bottom roller because uh well i mean the roller was on the regulator not on the window so there was no need and i was just struggling a little bit too much installing this here with the window in but now that it's on i can go ahead now and install the window here so, you know i'm gonna put the nut here just to keep it a little more safer a lot easier the window just fell into place on the rollers on the rails i mean now we have to put in that last piece that i have here that pretty much guides it okay, now that piece is installed there all the hardware for the actual window quick note for this piece here make sure it's actually you know on or the the window piece the part that goes into this rail make sure it's in it because it does have like a bigger head on the edge, which fits right there. So that way it doesn't get off there on the rail. So just make sure of that. I just noticed that and on this side, I noticed that it didn't have it on that side. So I'm not sure if this piece that I have for here is the wrong one for that side or the window itself is messed up. I don't know, weird. All right, so now that we have this mechanism here buttoned up, now we can go ahead and throw this piece here it's pretty much the last piece that we need all right guys so there you guys have it installed this here and now we have a window although to be honest with you i think i might have some mismatched pieces here because uh when i roll it down this rail here on this side it might be too short or this piece might not be the one or the regulator itself or the window itself I'm not really sure but it kind of like falls off like it, it just you know there's not enough track so it just falls off completely so that kind of sucks but i mean overall this is this is how you do it and well hopefully this video wasn't too convoluted and stuff but we made it happen we got the door finally so make sure to like comment and subscribe for future content see you guys the next time peace